A Starbucks manager just confirmed our suspicions. The company has been directing management to punish pro-union employees. Let's talk about it. In August, the National Labor Relations Board held a hearing regarding union busting at the Buffalo Starbucks store. At the hearing, a former Starbucks manager named David Allman testified under oath that he was instructed to punish pro-union workers. Specifically, Almond was given a list of pro-union workers and told to discipline them. The higher-ups even gave him examples of non-union related things he could discipline the workers for. Like wearing purple pants. Oh, and they also told him to follow around a pro-union worker. When discussing a stellar employee in favor of unionizing, leadership said, I'm sure there's something we can use against her. This testimony only confirms the suspicions of Starbucks Workers United. This year, Starbucks has fired over 120 pro-union workers for completely arbitrary reasons, like wearing a suicide awareness pin. Almond also testified that Starbucks directed him to alter schedules so that managers were always in the store to intimidate workers. As of right now, over 250 Starbucks stores have voted to unionize.